I have this horrendous opposition to the term fees. The, the usage of the term fees gives some legitimacy to what workers are paying for these jobs. Bangladeshis are paying on average uh, more than anybody else except Pakistanis. Um, and they're paying on average from the research that we've done is about $3,300 for these jobs. Now that is not a fee for the services of the recruitment agent, right? It's far too large. Um, I mean, it's to feed the corruption. The thing is that there's money that's being given to the personnel of the employing company in the country of destination. That is the payment that is given. It's what we call a, a kickback bribe uh, or a kickback payment for whoever is actually choosing that agency to get the contract to provide the labor. Now, for Bangladeshis, I have seen uh, a man in, uh, in paper, on paper, saying that they will pay $1,000 uh, per worker to the employer. Uh, I've seen another one that said $1,500. So where does that money go? Pre before COVID, there was about 500,000 Bangladeshis leaving Bangladesh every year. At a thousand dollars, half a billion dollars leaving the country with them in order to, to pay the, um, uh, the, the kickback payments. So this money that is being called fees is a nonsense.